Welcome to Premath. In this video, we have got this uh, green uh, shaded uh, circle with the center of fully inscribed uh, in a blue triangle uh, ABC. As you can see in this given diagram, such that the points uh, D, E, and uh, F uh, are our points of tangency. And moreover, the area of this uh, green shaded uh, circle has been given to us as uh, 144 times pi centimeter square. And furthermore, uh, the perimeter of this uh, blue triangle has been given to us uh, as 126 uh, centimeter. In other words, the sum of all these uh, three side lengths uh, of this uh, triangle uh, is uh, 126 centimeter. And now our task is to calculate the area of this uh, blue triangle uh, ABC. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. And please keep in mind that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started. And here's our very first step. We are going to focus on this uh, green uh, shaded uh, circle. And we are going to calculate uh, its radius. I'm going to label the radius uh, lowercase r and now we are going to find the value of lowercase r and now let's recall the area of a circle formula area is always equal to pi r square where lowercase r is the radius and here in our case uh, the area of this uh, circle has been given as 144 times pi so therefore let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this formula so we got area as 144 times uh, pi equal to pi times uh, lowercase uh, r square and now i'm going to divide both sides uh, by pi and here we can see this pi and pi is gone likewise this pi and pi is gone as well so therefore uh, r square value simply turns out to be 144 and now i am going to undo this square by taking a square root on both uh, sides so therefore our uh, radius uh, lowercase r of this uh, green shaded circle turns out to be 12 centimeter so therefore uh, the radius uh, turns out to be equal to 12 centimeter and here's our next step now we are going to focus on this uh, blue triangle i'm going to label uh, this side length uh, as uh, lowercase a this uh, side length uh, as uh, lowercase b and this side length uh, of this uh, triangle as uh, lowercase c then the perimeter of this uh, blue triangle is going to be sum of all these uh, side uh, lengths uh, a plus b plus c so therefore our perimeter p turns out to be equal to a plus b plus uh, c and now we know that uh, the triangle perimeter is equal to 126 so therefore i could write uh, side lengths uh, a plus b plus c must be equal to 126 centimeter and i'm going to label this one as our uh, equation number one and here's our next step i'm going to connect uh, this center of with all these uh, points of tangency d e and uh, f as you can see in this uh, next step i have connected uh, these points and now we can see this uh, o d is the radius of this uh, green shaded circle i'm going to label this one as uh, lowercase r this is uh, radius as well so this is lowercase r and lowercase r across the board and now let's recall the circle theorem according to this theorem the angle between the radius uh, and the tangent line will uh, always be exactly 90 degrees so no wonder uh, all these uh, three angles uh, have got to be a uh, 90 degrees uh, each since uh, these are our radii and these uh, are uh, our tangent lines and now in this uh, next step i'm going to connect uh, this center row uh, with these uh, vertices uh, a b and c as you can see in this uh, next step we got uh, a o 
B, O and C, O. And as a result, we got these uh, three triangles. This first triangle is uh, our triangle uh, A, O, B. The next triangle is our uh, triangle uh, B, O, C. And finally, the third triangle is our triangle uh, A, O, C. So therefore we conclude that the area of this uh, blue triangle ABC is going to be equal to the sum of uh, these uh, three individual uh, triangle areas. This uh, first uh, triangle AOB area, the triangle BOC area and finally the triangle uh, AOC area. And now let's recall the area of a triangle formula. Area is always equal to a half time base times the height of the triangle. So therefore, for this triangle uh, AOB area, our uh, base uh, is uh, C and our radius is lowercase r. So therefore, I could write uh, the area of triangle AOB is uh, a half times our base is uh, C times our radius is r plus, let's focus on triangle uh, BOC area. For triangle BOC area, the base uh, is uh, lowercase a and the radius is lowercase r. So therefore I could write a half uh, times uh, a times uh, lowercase r plus. And finally on this uh, triangle uh, AOC area we could see our base uh, is uh, b and our radius is lowercase r. So therefore I can write uh, a half uh, times uh, b times the radius lowercase r. And now let's make an observation. We can see 1 divided by 2, 1 divided by 2 and 1 divided by 2 they are in common. And likewise uh, lowercase r is common as well. So therefore we can factor out uh, lowercase r divided by 2 and in parentheses we are ended up with the lowercase a plus lowercase b plus uh, lowercase c. And now let's make an observation. We know our radius lowercase r is 12. So I'm going to substitute 12 value over here. And likewise from this equation 1 we know our a plus b plus c value is 126. So I'm going to substitute uh, that value 126 over here. So therefore I could write uh, lowercase r radius is 12 divided by 2 times uh, 126 and that is going to give us 6 times uh, 126 and if we multiply that is going to give us uh, 756 uh, centimeter square the area of the triangle uh, ABC and now let me show you the alternative approach as well and here's the straight up formula that we could use the triangle area from the in radius and the formula is uh, the triangle area is always equal to r times s and in our case our radius lowercase r is uh, 12 where s stands for semi perimeter and the semi perimeter is simply the perimeter value divided by 2 so therefore our uh, lowercase s value is going to be perimeter is 126 divided by 2 is going to give us uh, lowercase s value as uh, 63. Let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, equation. So we got our radius uh, 12 times uh, our uh, s value as 63 and if we multiply that is going to give us uh, 756 uh, centimeter square. So thus the area of this uh, blue triangle ABC turns out to be 756 uh, centimeter square. And that's our final answer. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.